that the Oklahoma Statewide Charter School Board had been dragging their feet on terminating that contract, even after the state Supreme Court ruled St. Isidore wasn't legal. They initially believed the contract was needed to challenge the school's legality at the federal level. Well, I, I was actually mistaken. Our attorneys did, uh, actually clarified that for us and saying actually it, it doesn't change anything because the, the appeal is in place. The Attorney General has threatened a contempt charge when that board left the contract in place. As it stands today, though, the state Supreme Court ruling still stands and Isidore will not open in the fall, and the contract has now been rescinded. Lawyers for the school are still petitioning the Supreme Court, hoping U.S. Supreme Court support justices will take on the case and eventually override the state court. That's that Oklahoma cannot fund a religious institution. While the contract has been tossed out, the board did vote to reinstate it immediately if St. Isidore wins their legal fight before the U.S. Supreme Court. Reporting live in the newsroom, I'm Andy Weber, KOCO 5 News.